Hey, what's going on guys? Welcome back to my channel. Today we're gonna be cleaning my master built electric smoker. in front of you is a typical electric smoker that should be a window you should be able to see through that uh, it's gone through some wars already and uh, it needs to be cleaned I'm gonna take you through my steps or my process that I use to um, go ahead and clean this up I'm gonna go ahead and start off with the window now what I'm using today is uh, this oven cleaner by members mark I'll go ahead and I'll put a link on the description below if you guys are interested uh, after you see the, what it can do and I'm normally not the type, but for this uh, degreaser, wow, you need to put on some gloves so that you don't get any of this stuff on your hands because if, uh, if you do get it on your hands, it does a number on them. Dries them out really bad for a while. Gets into the beds of your nails and nah, not good. No bueno. All right, so let's go ahead and uh, open this up. Let the magic happen. It's been a couple of minutes. All I'm going to do is I'm going to add a little bit of water. I'm not forcing the water right now. There's no pressure. It's just, I mean, that's just after one round. I were to put a little bit of pressure on it. All right, so you can see right there, look at how much has already been taken off with just one, one application. I'm gonna go ahead and I'm gonna spray it again. This stuff is powerful. And what I like about this stuff is that it's meant, it's meant for the uh, ovens and, and the stuff that you use to cook on. Uh, in my other videos, I've used Purple Power before, which is another powerful degreaser. The only thing is that you have to go find that in the automotive section. So something wasn't sitting well with me, finding something to clean my, something I cook on from the automotive section. So I, I discovered this gym and I haven't looked back since. I could probably just wet this one more time and then apply more. But what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna give it a little bit of assistance with this. I mean, you're talking about just gentle rubbing. This will cut your manual part of cleaning your smoker by about 95%. I mean, I've done it to where I don't even do this. I just apply it a couple of times and then just let it run off. But I want to give it a nice little 
cleaning before we go into the, the main chamber here. And this is why I tell you use gloves because this thing's this thing can get in your hand on your hands and yeah, it's not a pretty sight. Let me nudge it off. Just give it a nice little, can you see right through it? All right, so let's start working on the inside. Let me zoom out a little bit more. I'll give it a couple of minutes for it to really seep in and start messing with it. I'm going to zoom out a little bit more so you guys can start getting the whole effect on the bottom. It's been exactly one minute since I, I stopped applying, so I'll give it another minute. Yeah, this thing has no no chance start looking at the bottom start looking at all that good stuff starting to come off i don't know if you can see there without me even touching it you can already see some of that some of the the shininess starting to come out all right it's been two minutes I mean, you could probably leave it here longer. I'm just very um, impatient. I want to see what this looks like, but here we go. All right, so it's been a couple of minutes. Again, you don't have to do this if you don't want to. I'm just gonna do it to get the maximum cleanliness out of this as possible. So I'm gonna go in there, I'm just gonna gently rub it down. And a little water won't hurt. I'll throw one more time just so it can look pretty. Because I don't like those little streaks right there. My OCD does not let me leave it alone this is just for my own personal these packs I do have a link on the description below but these packs you get three of these babies for 
I don't know. I don't know what they're running right now, but I got them and um, well worth it. Well worth it. And what I like about them is that they're meant for cooking surfaces. Do a nice little gentle washing here, cleaning. And there you go guys let me know what you guys think on the comments below um this has saved me a ton of time and a ton of effort getting my um my uh, smoker cleaned up again just so you can see kind of like what it looks like now compared to what it used to look like that's a major major difference all right this has been the smoking beer thank you for watching please don't forget to like and subscribe and i'll catch you guys on the flip side